Care Act jeopardizes care for the elderly, compromises the beliefs of pro-life Americans, penalizes job creators, limits states' flexibility under Medicaid, and results in job losses. You know, I believe that individuals with pre-existing conditions uh, should have access to care. Also, if you change your job, you and your family should be able to keep your health uh, insurance. These are simple solutions that both parties of Congress could have agreed to adopt. But instead of advancing a bill that focuses on access to care, protects the patient and doctor relationship, and lowers health care premiums through increased competition and choice, the President signed a $1.445 trillion law that reduces seniors' Medicare benefits $523 billion and raises taxes $569 billion. Further, this carelessly drafted law includes mandatory funding that bypasses the standard committee process. I'll support today's bills that defund and or make mandatory funding subject to the normal appropriations process. Thank you, and I yield back the balance of my time.